Well then, Joe Cornahan, Carnahan, I always forget how to say his last name. Gerard Butler, Frank Grillo, Alexis, I uh, can't remember her name, but um, hey, that was good. I enjoyed that. Started off a little, you know, where I was going, is this trying to be as, cl- is this trying to be too clever and it's not going to work? And then it ended up being pretty clever. So, you know, so that ended up being uh, pretty damn enjoyable because, you know, if you remember Joe, is, he's the guy who did uh, Smoking Aces. You know, that's kind of like a free fire, people going after a guy. So let's take that and have it more contained, a little more contained. That's what, that's what Cop Shop is. Then, uh, you know, you got the small police station that's happening. Yeah, that's interesting. I'm actually at a... I'm actually at the old theater I used to go to all the time because the you know screening was, was earlier than the other one that I usually go to. It's weird. I know this is totally off subject. I enjoy the movie. Go for it. But it's totally off subject because, I mean, even though I've, I haven't been in this movie theater in years, so a whole new company, company owns it, so walking through the halls and stuff and just walking in there, it was, it was weird because, you know, you're always used to it. It was a Krikorian at first. I don't think Krikorians even exist anymore. I'm not even sure. And now it's all... It looked like a it looked like a lounge. I mean, they had a bar area, and of course you can get food and stuff like that. But you know how, like, you go go to some place that you've, you, know, you remember from, like, your childhood or your teenage years or something like that, and, <laughs> uh, and it feels familiar, but not at the same time. It was kind of, it was kind of strange, but you know, it was cool. But anyways, yeah. Um, go check it out. Small movie. And support small movies. Original ideas. Do that because, yeah, it was, it was enjoyable. Enjoyable.